about downsizing from the guzzler you were just talking about. How practical is that for them? About 1.6, 1.7, 1.5. We're okay. still working out because they're going to be produced locally. But I said, you call the CEO and uh, you speak to her, but the vehicle is anyway going to be around. To get it's the specs. so proud to have it uh, uh, produced locally. Uh, we already, just two days before this, we already have a request for about uh, 314 units uh, order, pre-ordered. Wow. And uh, we are looking to have that uh, met before December. So. So that's, that's how we're doing it. So 300 yeah. vehicles coming in. I was looking at a Keeper Those report. Those are orders. Those are orders. Orders. Of the vehicles the that will be coming people in. People who are saying, I want it. And actually 100 or something, the CEO was telling me earlier today, has been done by the Honorable President of Kenya. People are just saying, I want that one that's being driven by the president. And you'll need the infrastructure to <laughs> charge, because right now Keeper is saying we have five charging stations in Nairobi, one in Mombasa. What no, are the plans no, to no. scale? We, we, need, we need to understand this, and I, I am happy you're talking about this. First of all, the, that car can be charged in your own home. Okay. Uh, so you only need a few hours to charge. Few means overnight as you sleep, uh, between uh, four, four hours to, to eight hours, depending if you're using a fast charger or a slow charger. Uh, and therefore you can charge it at home and you don't need any more than uh, than uh, what you charge at home because it's it's uh, 300 kilometers the green one the avocado green car that you can see there is uh, is uh, gives you 200 kilometers you don't need more than that so you can charge at home but even more than that the ev uh, uh, mobility association yeah. is having members who are doing one of them has got 16 different uh, locations with chargers in the city, in Nakuru and other places. Uh, so this should not worry anybody else. And I must remind Kenyans and your viewers that this is mature technology. People can be able to, to use this uh, and, and without any problem. The only thing that we have is the culture. Mm. The bigger the car I drive, the more successful I look. Status symbol. And this yeah. is, this is uh, where it's only the level of my my dear in-law here can deal with uh, by showing by example, yeah. by, by working on things like we are talking about decarbonizing our economy and our constitution and getting to all this, relating to the issues of uh, carbon that, and that Mwanainchi can understand when you lock yourself in a garage and put on your car, you will die. When you put on charcoal in your room, and uh, no any additional air, you will die. That is what the cars that are on the road today are doing. They are the reason why our rivers are drying. They are the reason why we have uh, sicknesses, like uh, CS has just said. They are the reason why we are not having money in our pockets. They are the reason why money is being diverted to buy fertilizer, because Africa has lost a third of its production of uh, agricultural output because of related issues on, on carbon, uh, on, on, on climate change. Yeah. And therefore we need to start, that is why the importance of carbon and what has come up now, unprecedented in the world, that out of this meeting, that we are now going to have a carbon tax where people were selling Carbon, it has been at about 40 shillings to 80 shillings, $80 Dollars, yeah, to yeah. Uh, $80. Who said it's like preparing charcoal and then you put it on the road and then expect that a truck that is going to pass by. So, Leo Munanunua na Pesangapi. And yet you're the one who has produced all this. Right. And there is, a, uh, there is a way that you can be doing it. Why is it not $200? Why is it not $500? Uh, whatever it is. So we have a product that the emitters out there, take it or leave it. We find we have something that we can share on the table. Yeah. And that is the direction we need to take. So I, I, I wish to assure Kenyans that this is a good direction. Uh, we need to lead by example. I expect and look forward. The, the family of uh, electric mobility now is growing. 
the biggest companies, of course, globally, with naming Honda, which I'm part of, naming uh, uh, Bajaj and, uh, and uh, other uh, TVS and other companies, the global pie chart will remain the same. Yeah. The leader will always be the leader and others, including other suppliers of this. And just to be clear for our viewers, you know, greening the urban transport system is not just e-mobility. No, right? you no, know, We no, need more no. people walking.